Alright guys, uh, end of turn 3 for the Salamanders. Uh, a few bits and pieces happened. Uh, managed to get replacements, so as you see, got the engine woes back. So it didn't really do a lot when it came back in, but was it stunned your. Sorry. <laughs> stunned your wave, wave serpent, wasn't yeah, it? 28 knots can fired and stunned. It blinded the pilot so he can't, the gunners who can't shoot. Um, yeah, and then the was it surface blast from the thunderfire? What well, is not a thunderfire cannon, but it is really the, 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 yeah. Yeah, uh, took out was it two yeah, models? Took out one one model, guard. one wraith guard out um, of that squad there. Um, the tactical squad uh, beside it, uh, they fired, got a wound, but he made his save. And they did two wounds in the bolt guns, and they made a save. Oh yeah, sorry, yeah, you made your saves. So moving along, we got Vulcan and his squad here. Uh, they made it through the dangerous terrain test. However, uh, Vulcan and one of the Terminators tripped over his own shoelaces, and uh, Vulcan took a wound, but the Terminator managed to steady himself. So Vulcan's down four wounds, and he's got the Avatar to face next. So. And your uh, your scout yeah. managed to rally and move back into the crater. So we'll see what he can do on the next turn. So stand by for the end of the Eldar turn three. So all right, I'll catch you in a few again, guys. Hey guys, end of Eldar turn three. Uh, ben, if you want to take us through what happened. Well, unfortunately, you've uh, stunned most of my vehicles, but uh, this wave serpent moved forward just to make sure I can catch what's in range and blasted away everything that can kill the scout that's hiding here, finally. Unfortunately, your auto environment stunned the gunner on the warp hunter so it couldn't shoot, but it's just moved up in case. Uh, the night spinner at the backfield there, it took a shot at the land raider of the engine of woes. It hit, got a dead on hit, it rendered and got glancing and did nothing. Um, but it's going to take a dangerous train test if it tries to move next time. The Wraith Guard there, they shot and stunned it. Oh no, no, so they shot and they blew off the Thunderfire cannon. The Warlock failed to do a repeat of the Archon Land Speeder and just <laughs> the speed just bounced off and came back. The Wraith Lord there, it moved up, flamed them, but flamed that squad, both its flamers, and did it kill one? Uh, they survived, but when he assaulted, he killed one. Yeah, he's, he's gone to assault. Um, the other squads here have done nothing. They've got no targets at the moment. But this is the nice titanic battle going on over here. We've got the Avatar that charged in with the race here. And because of the Avatar, he gives fearless and fewest charge to everything in the 24, which meant the record over there went first. He went first, and the race here went first over here. And it was a titanic clash, the avatar hit with four out of nine attacks, wounded and Kev made every single save. Yep, Vulcan made three threes and two five saves. So. And then Vulcan struck back and he hit with all, all but four, one. Yeah, four he attacks wound, hit back. He wounded with three and I saved all of mine. Um, and the race here was the star of this combat so far, he's killed one terminator and taken no damage in return. So it's looking good so far. So at this point, um, pretty much the best the Salamanders can hope to achieve is surviving combat. Although killing an avatar is an achievement. Which it's an achievement in itself. So especially with the was it Wraith Seer supporting it. So yes. we'll see what happens in uh, Salamanders turn four. So not going too well for me. Going very well for Ben. And uh, we'll see what happens in the next two turns. Right. Catch you back later.